There's no such thing as work-life balance. None! Learn to be super successful. Subscribe to my channel, Meathead. The New York Athletic Club used to be a club that was worth joining. Uh, but I mean, uh, the Harvard Club, the Cornell Club in New York City, uh, I, I don't know if Penn has those kind of clubs, uh, but um, the, um, in my part of the world, the Jonathan Club, the California Club in Los Angeles, uh, in Vancouver, the Vancouver Club, um, uh, there are clubs that, um, that you're going to be uh, associated with high-performance people. And there's two committees that you should get on when you join the club. First of all, if you're less than 30, they get a special rate. Give you 10, 20 years to pay. If you're less than 35, if you're less than 40. For those of you guys that are over 40 or 50, they don't give you any special rate. You, just, you gotta pay to join. But you wanna join the finance committee and the membership committee. Not the Christmas party committee, not the golf committee. Finance and Christmas, oh, excuse me, finance and uh, uh, membership. Because you're gonna be able to view who's joining. And you'll be able to cherry pick somebody that you want to introduce yourself to. And most of the high performance people that I've been privileged to be around, I went up and knocked on their door, with a couple of uh, exceptions, and say, my, my name's Dan Pena, uh, uh, can, I, can I buy you lunch? Or now you don't need to buy you a cup of coffee, okay? Uh, and I've been around some pretty good guys. But it's the clubs that you can't afford. I also say join Rotary. I also say join um, Toastmaster, yeah, Toastmaster. Uh, and when you join Toastmaster, because most of you can't sell a piece of ass in a lumber camp, because your communication skills are so poor. Because now, especially the current generation and a half, have grown up on a computer. And you even text things to people. You know, I mean, that's, uh, I can't believe that. I mean, uh, business decisions. So you want to be able to speak. So when you join uh, Toastmasters, you want to be in the front row where you're competing uh, and you're actually giving presentations, not in the viewing row back in the bleachers.